Welcome, Julia, to this massage. Thank you. I'm so happy to have you here. It's been way too long since our last video. It has been. And you've never been in a massage video before either. That's true. Only the medical ones. So you'll get quite a bit of pampering done today. So we'll be doing a seated chair massage, a scalp massage, neck, shoulders, trapezius, as well as your arms and your upper back. How does that sound? Sounds amazing. So, how are you feeling in this moment in terms of your body? Is there anywhere that's feeling sore, tense, tight, or just needs a little bit of attention? My shoulders are a little bit tight. Okay. And the top of my neck on the right side is kind of sore. Right here? Yeah. So I'm just palpating to see which areas are a little tighter. So about here? Yeah. Okay. Just palpate the other side. It's a little tight here as well. It is, yeah. Okay. Yeah, all of this feels really tight here. Do you think it's just because you've been sitting a lot? Yeah, I think that that's mostly it. I, I also had an injury a couple mm. years ago, and so the sitting just makes it worse. Oh, I see. Yeah. Okay. We'll definitely pay attention to this area. Thank you. And I want to start off this massage with burning a bit of sweet grass, if that's okay. Okay. So Julia, I invite you to breathe the sweet scent in. It's nice. Thanks. I believe you also braided this, right? I have one too, yeah. Right? It was about two years ago, wasn't it? Yeah. I'm just gonna burn a bit more. Okay. I haven't burned mine yet. Oh. <laughs> Where have you kept it? It's in, um, where is it? It's in a wooden chest Aww. that I have on my drawer. Are you keeping it safe? Yes. Waiting for the right time. Oh, I love that. <laughs> so we'll just breathe this in together. Inhale. your energy today. I'm just gonna have you raise your arm. Okay, good. So here's a local canvas goose feather that we found 
last time we went for a bit of a walk with Angelica and Tina. And I'm just going to be sweeping around you. going to allow the sensation of this feather to bring us into the present moment. Away from any thoughts that might be troubling us. Also, kind of help us prepare for the massage just with this light touch. massage oil. It's made by my good friend Anna. Um, she has a small business called Azusar and this is a jasmine scented massage oil. Really smell it. It's nice. I think these are actually jasmine flowers inside. Oh, wow. Yeah.
Alright, Julie, I'm just going to brush your hair. You fit it all in. I did. Is it usually hard to do so? <laughs> yeah. Was I in your massage class back in first year? I think so. I think Chloe was as well. And Dania. Yeah. That was so long ago. I know. You remember your techniques? I always have to review them a bit. <laughs> Me too. So, how has internship been for you so far? really fun. Um, it's also, it's a new type of learning mm -hmm. and it's exciting to learn with real patience. Everything feels more real and applicable compared to the lectures mm -hmm. and it sticks a little bit better and it's beautiful to see how one treatment and one condition can be managed um, completely differently depending on the patient, just based right. on where they're at or their unique presentation. Mm -hmm. So it's been it's been a really cool learning process so far. Oh, I'm so glad. Yeah, you're taking it so positively. I know there's been a lot of challenges too. <laughs> Yeah, it is hard. I mean, we learn, we learn the books and then learning to work with patients for real is, is its own thing and they can't necessarily prepare you for all of it. Mm -hmm. You've had really good luck with your supervisors, right? Yeah, I love my supervisors. Now we're gonna be in person. Mm -hmm. How do you feel about that? I'm really excited. I liked 
aspects of virtual um, but I like that it can be either now and mm. patients have a choice and you just get something more in person in my opinion right both the patient's experience and from a practitioner's standpoint mm. being able to really see and talk to a patient really are you feeling about starting clinic? No, I'm not starting until a year later. I know. Are you thinking about it though? <laughs> I am. Um, it's going to be a lot different compared to all the videos that I do, I'm sure. Right? You yeah, probably... but this is really good preparation. I hope so. Let me know if this is too much pressure or too little. It feels so good. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. You're probably going to have a lot more practice with acupuncture, right? Yes, I hope so. It's manipulation. Yeah. Massage, hydrotherapy, all of that. Yeah, exactly. working either side of the spine, the parispinals. Okay, good. I'm just gonna bring my arm around your shoulders like this and then Use my knuckles back here to work on the rhomboids. Just loosen them up. Need the upper traps and paraspinals. I want to apply a bit of peppermint halo if that's okay with you. Yeah, that'd be great. Yeah. I usually like applying this to the neck back here. Mm. Okay. 
And I'll just go all the way down. Would you like some on your forehead too? Sure. right back to eating the neck. How is this pressure? It's perfect. Okay. So I'm working all the way up to the axis. And then all the way down to C7. And further down the thoracic spine. Does feel looser now. Okay, so I think the scalenes here on the side are quite tight, so we're just going to do a bit of a stretch. Okay, I'm just going to hold down the side. Few deep breaths in here. Inhale and exhale. Let it all go into the ground. going to use my elbow okay. and work into the trap a little bit more. And just 
breathe through this because it might be a bit sore. I also want to loosen up your shoulder joint a bit. Okay. So what we're going to do is have my arm under there. Okay. And then I'm just going to rotate back like that. So you don't have to do any work, just let me do the work. Okay, there you go. Julia. So now we're going to move on to the scalp massage. Okay. I'm just going to take out all of these bobby pins.
So I'm just going to use this head massage tool. Okay. Have you ever tried this before? I have. Oh, did I you enjoy this? it? Yes. Okay. So I'm just going to... Oh, just sort of scratch your scalp. It always gives me goosebumps. Oh. so much. It's um, great. And you're ready to go to bed. Yeah. All relaxed. Sleepy. sleepy. It's good. Okay. 